<clears throat> now, Rand, this is a standard T hanger, and it's at Zephyr Hills, and it's hanger number what? It's uh, hanger four, unit number nine, and uh, as you can see, probably, I don't know about this angle, but we got about a little over a foot of clearance on each side uh, of the hanger with the wing tips off. Okay. Wing tips are there. Watch it. Okay, we're going. Okay, and as I showed you, the three wing, uh, the three pins on the wing tip extension fit into these three holes. That's the aft hole that's into the flapper on there. This pin hole and a pin hole up here in the front, and that ensures that the wing is lined up properly as we slide it in. tool required is a six inch hex screw or hex wrench. If you feel up top there's actually a little hole there and as long as you can feel the top of the screw up you know you've got a good connection. So we're done with that wing tip. Taking it off is even simpler because it just pulls out. There is no requirement to line anything up. It's very good. Okay, crazy. and it's on. Great. There. We can pull on the end just to make sure, but it's nice and sturdy. And the flapper on is anchored.